Welcome to Ken's Corner Podcast, Season 3. Get ready for expert analysis and rising wrestling stars. Now here we go with your host, Ken Judge. Hi everyone, this is Ken from Ken's Corner, and I got a special guest on for you tonight. Back with me, uh, well, he was way, way back when and somewhere in Season 1. But uh, it's always fun to, to have returnees here on Ken's Corner. Uh, everyone uh, say hi to uh, professional wrestler uh, Andrew Love. And Andrew, you've been pretty busy. I've seen you all over the East Coast. I believe your uh, better half, your girlfriend's also uh, doing some refing all over the country as well. So, but anyway, how are you doing? And then we're going to get to what we're going to talk about here today. I'm good. Uh, she's not my girlfriend no more, but that's okay. Yeah. I'm sorry. To, I'm sorry with that one. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Uh, whatever. Um, yeah, I've been doing well. I've been resting all over Canada in the last like two years and stuff. I think the last time I was on here was like October 2022. It was yeah. around there. So it's it's been it's been a while, but like since then I wrestled like all over Canada. I've done extra work with TNA and stuff. So, but I'm back in. Back in Ontario for now. I don't know what the future holds. You don't know where I'll be next. I just, I just play it by year. Yeah. Well, I actually seen you as an extra on WWE. Uh, lo and behold, one day I turn on my favorite show, and there's Andrew Love <laughs> as, as part of the show with Kevin Owens walking by you. <laughs> yeah. So I was laying on the floor. Yeah, <laughs> you definitely were. But hey, you take it as it goes, right? <laughs> you get yeah, your foot yeah. in that door. Anyway, we're going to talk about the show that you got coming up with two shows, actually. Uh, but we're going to start with the one in Oshawa. I believe it's uh, promoted by Chaos. And if I'm right, it's called Space Jam. Uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's it's at the rehearsal factory, which is like a music factory, but they do wrestling here too now. And uh, we've been running shows inside, and this is the first time we're going outside, so there's no capacity. We just num- no no number limit. Uh, we were only allowed forty people in last time, so so now we're no capacity and it's called space slam space slam i'm sorry yeah you're thinking the the, the, the movie yeah yeah i'm thinking of michael jordan yeah <laughs> well i'm talking to a superstar just like him so <laughs> some similarities yeah. there right yeah yeah he has a lot more money <laughs> yeah that's 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 true but who yeah. knows one day andrew one day you're still a young guy yeah Keep hopefully pushing keep pushing away tell us a little bit more about the show who's uh who's on that um, show who are you wrestling yeah uh, i'm wrestling tyler arrow uh it's gonna be the hardcore match you know um my uh last show we did i wrestled kobe durst and i, I beat him in a hardcore match and the crowd loved it and before that we did a show and my uh best friend he costed me the match but we still won he tried to cost me the match but we i still won my team me and gunner lang when we were partners um Love guns. And, uh, yes. And like, so, uh, this guy who used to be my friend, he cost me my match trying to. So I have, uh, he's putting me in like all these hardcore matches now. And hopefully we can, uh, come out in one piece. Yeah. That's, that's true. I do remember being in Peterborough and you, uh, threw a Clash Kincaid off my foot. <laughs> yes. Yeah. I remember that too. <laughs> that was a memorable night. <laughs> Uh, we're going to talk a little bit about my hometown show. Uh, I'm actually going to see you there. I, I got a, a promo that I'm going to do for Ken's Corner that night. So I'm really excited to get in the exact ring that you're going to be wrestling in. So I'm not sure what you're doing that night, but I'm going to get to that point. You're, I mean, you'll get to that point. But it is called uh, NSW Just Getting Started right here in Stouffville. And there you are. There I am, yeah. <laughs> so I'm tell not- us a bit about this show. This is uh, Gunnar Lang's, uh, like, uh, this is his goal. This is something he's been looking forward to, something he's been wanting to do his whole life, is run a wrestling show in Stouffville. Um There hasn't been one since the 1970s. And, like, I learned on your show that the last time there was a wrestling show there, the, a dude wrestled a bear. And, like, <laughs> we, we, don't, we don't have any bears, but we have some wild animals there that, that or humans that act like wild animals. So, <laughs> uh, but... Uh, is that the Stovall a- crowd or is that the wrestlers? <laughs> Oh, that's the wrestler for sure. <laughs> I think the Stouffville people are very nice and friendly. You know, they're letting uh, wrestling into their town. So any company, any or town that lets wrestling into their area is 
good in my books. Yeah, Stovo, um, Stovo's definitely a good talent. And, and actually, I just want to give you a bit of insight. I don't know if you know, uh, I have a cousin who actually works at that Stovall Arena, and he's telling me that the ring is already in place. So people are getting yeah. uh, excited for what's going to happen here. Yeah. And I, I'm hoping for a, a good crowd for you guys. Yes, Let, uh, let's talk about your match. Yeah, um, I'm in a I'm in a rumble to declare the first ever uh, Grand Champion. Um, there's 15 other wrestlers, and men and women are going to be in that match. It's, it's going to so be a that, tough one to survive, but you know I'm going to try my best and survive. Is that over the top? Yeah, over the top. And I heard the final two people are one on one. That's exciting. It's exciting. Mm -hmm. that, so that's going to take a better part of the second half of that show, I believe. Yeah, I could imagine. Yeah, there's 15 wrestlers. Yeah, that's great. That's great. Um, well, since we're at it and we're still here, um, do you have anything else that you want to talk about? Any other upcoming shows or exciting uh, my, news? Uh, my schedule is crazy. I'm wrestling every weekend until October and then uh, every weekend in November and December. So October is a little slow, but I know it will pick up. Uh, I'm going to be like, all over. If, if there's a town, I'm probably going to be there. That's um, awesome. That's awesome. Um, I want to say one thing. I hope you're a Leaf fan, but go Leafs go. It is hockey yeah. season. <laughs> it's yeah, fitting yeah. that you're on our hockey pad. So that's that's interesting. Yes. yes. And uh, hopefully, uh, yeah, I'm not, I don't really watch much hockey, but I always hope for the Leafs to win. Well, that's amazing. You know what? I, I don't think you have much time in your professional career. Like As you say, you're, you're on the go. You're on the go. Yeah. I am a fan of the Oscar Generals too because they're my hometown team. And uh, when I wrestled in Peterborough last month, I wore Oscar Generals jersey. <laughs> I don't and, blame uh, you. I'm an Oscar yeah. General fan as well, yeah. Andrew. <laughs> oh, yeah. What was the response to that jersey? Oh, it was loud boos. <laughs> That's awesome. Um, well, that we're to the point of the show now. I'm just going to leave it the floor open to you to anything that you want to add to us here, for us here today, Andrew. I just I just hope people can come out to the show this Saturday in Stouffville. It's a big one. If you're in the Oshawa area, come out to uh, the show in Oshawa at the, at the rehearsal factory. And then on Sunday, we're in Lindsay, Ontario. So if you're in that area, that'd be cool too. But I just I hope to see everyone in, in Stouffville. That one's very important to my friend Gunnar Lang. So hopefully, hopefully it's the biggest show to ever hit the town. Yeah, you know what? I'm I'm hearing good things, and I know that uh, the radio station that I work for here in Stouffville has actually picked up on it after Gunner came on the air uh, this past Saturday, and I believe we're running commercials on Whistle Radio, which is uh, 102.9 FM Stouffville, just in case you need to know, or whistlefm.com. Um, I'm I'm hearing there's uh, commercials running, so I I, I hope that uh, Stovall comes out and enjoys what you guys the entertainment value that I know because I've I've seen you guys and so many times and and it's it's just so much fun and so much entertainment and you know what it's actually funner than a bigger production like the WWE because you get up and close with your your heroes and your heels you can get a yes. autograph you can get a picture during the halftime it's just so so much uh interaction and fun so i i hope everyone comes out to the to my hometown and sees andrew love so i guess we're gonna sign off here andrew i'm gonna yeah. leave the last 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 word for you uh just have fun with everything enjoy life try not to take it too serious and stay Stay humble, stay happy. That's all I got. <laughs> That's actually great words. Thank you very much. My name is Ken, and I'm from Ken's Corner. And today, I've been here with professional wrestler Andrew Love. Come out and see this uh, man play uh, wrestle. Um, I'm thinking hockey still, Andrew. <laughs> Come out and wrestle in Oshawa on the 25th, Stouffville on the 26th, and 27th in Lindsay, Ontario. Thank you very much, and you have a great day, Andrew. Thank you.